11x AI just raised $50 million, valuing the company at $350 million, making 11x AI one of the biggest AI agent companies. With these kind of sums floating around, you bet that there will emerge some competitors. That's why today I want to explain how MeChase AI agent works, so you could answer whether or not 11x's AI agents will be replaced by this small but mighty competitor. Before we can compare 11x to Chase, we have to understand what these platforms even do. Both of these platforms give you access to AI SDRs, basically bots that automate all the sales tasks for you, all the way from finding and validating leads to writing outreach and sending it out. These sales bots are also referred to as AI agents, and they're becoming increasingly more popular, with OpenAI CEO Sam Altman predicting that in a couple of years there will be millions or even billions of AI agents automating anything and everything. Now we know what AI agents do and how they work, but how is Chase AI any different from 11x AI? They both automate outbound, enhancing your sales team and booking sales calls on autopilot. First feature that makes Chase AI better than 11x is question handling. You see, whenever you get a reply on 11x, your AI agent will stop, not knowing what to do next. So every time you get a reply, you need to answer your prospect's questions manually, handling any objections or booking in sales calls. That's why Chase has an advantage. If you use Chase's AI agent, every time you get a reply, the AI agent will take care of it. The AI SDR will use your knowledge base to answer any questions or handle objections thrown by your prospect. Also, while 11x is cheaper than a real human SDR, the AI agent is still pretty expensive. 11x costs up to $1 per processed lead, so reaching out to 1,000 leads a month will cost you $1,000. Chase is different because it doesn't charge you anything for outreach. Chase simply charges $60 per meeting booked, all while it automatically sources leads for you. Now, if you'd want the same cost with 11x, you'd have to get a positive reply for every 60 emails sent. That's a 2% positive reply rate, not any reply rate, meaning your real reply rate should be more than 5%. Can 11x do that? I don't know. So let's try to answer the question we asked at the start. Will Chase AI replace 11x's AI agents? Well, no because 11x has already been replaced. You see, 11x would cost you about $2,000 to reach 2,000 prospects, while Agent Frank can do more than that for less than 500 bucks. And not only that, the AI SDR by Salesforce is built on top of more than 10 years of selling skills. And you know what happens when a platform that can automate hyper-personalized email and infrastructure setup creates an AI agent? Well, it's pretty darn good. I know it might be hard to believe what I say, but you don't have to. I suggest you book a demo for Agent Frank and see it all for yourself. I'll link it down in the description. See ya!